3.4 zeros of polynomial functions preparation. All right, example, determine whether the graph of x squared plus y squared is equal to 25 is symmetric with respect to the y-axis, the x-axis, or the origin. All right, so let's try y-axis, which means we plug in the opposite negative, which in this case is going to be a negative y. So what we do is we have a negative x squared plus y squared equals 25. A negative x squared is a positive x squared because a negative times a negative is positive. And we were able to get back the original equation. So check. Now what about x-axis? Now if it's x-axis, we want to plug in a negative y and square it. And that gives me a negative y times negative y, which is y squared. Positive y squared is equal to 25. And then that also works. Fair enough. And then at that point, we have the origin symmetry, origin symmetry. And what we do there is we plug in a negative x and we square it. Then we plug in a negative y and then we square it. And then we have the 25. Negative x squared is x squared. Negative y squared is y squared. And we were able to get back the original one. So because we were able to get back the original equation there. So this has all three types of symmetry.